for joining me. For this video I want to share with you how you can use a Stampin' Up! 12 by 12 page layout and create a card front just like I did on my hybrid project on my blog today at www.stampwithheather.ca. So in my digital studio I'm going to go up to insert and then I'm going to say add other template pages. When I do that I'm going to actually stick to the 12 by 12 square even though I'm creating a card front. So I'm going to come to my drop down menu here and I'm going to find my on the go. Here we go. And I'm going to say next and next, next and finish. And what's going to happen is it's going to import that into my card and into my project. But the elements you're going to notice are the same size as what they would be, or same proportions as they would be on a square as if this were a page. So all I'm going to do now is I'm going to select all of my elements. I'm going to come up to arrange. I'm going to group those. Then once they're grouped, I'm just going to scale it down until it fits my card front. I'm just going to turn my bleed area off there. So it's going to fit my card front as I would like. Now you will notice on my actual, so I'm going to come back down here to arrange ungroup. And I'll take off the text there. But you will notice in my card sample today that it's very similar to this. I did tweak it a little bit and I added designer paper where these pictures were. But you can see I used all of Stampin' Up's great hard work on their scrapbook page to make a really sweet birthday card uh, for my son's birthday party he had to go to this weekend. So check out my blog again at stampwithheather.ca to see my sample. But remember, when you're stuck or you're in a bind, use what Stampin' Up's done and modify it to what you need to work for you. Have a great day!